Bokeh images are a great way to alter the look of your depth of field. Standard bokeh with an aspect ratio of 1 is based on the image of a perfect circle. When you adjust the aspect ratio, it squeezes that image vertically or horizontally. You can use bokeh images that have different shapes to get a variety of looks. You can also use images with color to create a chromatic aberration effect. Place a camera in your scene and add the redshift camera tag. In the tag, go to the bokeh section and scroll down to image. Check the use bokeh image option. Locate an image to add. As you can see, it's now affecting the shape of our bokeh and adding a slight tint to the scene. When you add a bokeh image, the power, aspect, and shutter blade parameters stop working. You can alter the normalization mode to change how the image map tints the scene. Unit intensity mode tints the image based on the colors in the bokeh image, while white color sum removes an unwanted tinting from the in-focus pixels. In the description of the video, I've included a download link to a folder of basic bokeh images I created. If you don't mind spending a little money, I'd suggest purchasing this pack of bokeh images I found on ArtStation. It includes 95 bokeh images for around 20 bucks. If you found this video helpful, throw me a like down below and I'll see you in the next tutorial.